French Rap Music Awards, Les Flammes, honors Aya Nakamura. The first French ceremony dedicated to rap and popular culture set the stage ablaze with a night of diverse musical performances. The Flame of the Year rap album, the French rapper Ibrahima Diakite, a.k.a. Gazo, before the first edition of the Flame Award ceremony at the Chatelet Theatre in Paris on May 11, 2023. Rap industry professionals were delighted to see the orange carpet being rolled out in front of the Théâtre du Châtelet in Paris on Thursday, May 11. Gathered in this iconic center for Parisian cultural life, they celebrated the first edition of Les Flammes, a ceremony dedicated to rap and popular music. The festivities kicked off at 9.30 p.m. and concluded three hours later with a musical performance by the night's most awarded artists, rapper Gazo who won La Flamme for Male Artist and La Flamme Spotify for Album of the Year for KMT, and rapper Tia Cola, who collected three awards, including New Pop Album of the Year, for Mello. Aya Nakamura was awarded La Flamme for Female Artist of the Year, but she had already left the ceremony after a brief appearance, as she was in rehearsals for her show. The voters, composed of 140,000 internet users and a jury of professionals, also rewarded Dinos's album Hiver A Paris. The Cape Verdean singer Ronicia and the rapper Weranoi received Les Flammes for female and male discoveries of the year. The ceremony also rewarded other professions of the sector. Tariq Azuz, by being awarded Le Flamme for the composer of the year, wanted to pay tribute to his colleagues' backquote backquote beatmakers, these discrete profiles who shape our sound landscape. Celebrate the unifying power of rap as the ceremony progressed. The theater transformed into a concert hall. The speeches played second fiddle to the show. Gazzo did not waste any time when he was collecting his trophy. I will not speak for a long time, otherwise I will embarrass myself. All the way to the highest balcony, the audience was on its feet, dancing to the rhythms of the 14 performances throughout the evening. Gazzo's jerky drill tracks contrasted with the sweet melody of the song, Cray Dollar H, performed by Enchanted Julia and Prince Whaley. A few minutes earlier, comedian Ferry launched the party. In his opening monologue, he mocked the term, urban music, long used at the French mainstream music award show Victoires de la Musique. The organizers of Les Flammes proposed to rename this musical genre, Popular Cultures. Then, he reminds the importance of rap in the French musical landscape by taking its two leading figures as examples. Aya Nakamura is the French artist who sells the most in the rest of the world. July has sold as many platinum records as Johnny Halliday. The Marseille rapper was the big absentee at the ceremony. Ferry's introductory remarks set the tone for an evening that had one main ambition. To celebrate the unifying power of rap music. Fadili Kamara, comedian and co-host of the ceremony with rapper Driver, announced the ambition of the academy created by Yard and Busca P Media. We're going to correct history. The aim is to provide an understanding of the history of rap, the one that, according to them, the Victoires de la Musique misunderstood, and that Les Flammes have chosen to celebrate. An eternal flame, an honorary title that rewards a key figure in the discipline, was awarded by the rapper SCH to Lerat Luciano, rapper from Marseille of the group Funky Family, active between the 1990s and 2000.